When I went through my own experience of healing, I was presented with antidepressants or six sessions of counselling. Twenty odd years later, I've discovered there is so much more that is helpful, which really helps you to enrich your life and heal parts of yourself that you never thought were possible. So it's about bringing together a community to inspire people to find different ways to connect to their own inner healing. It's been deeply grounding for me actually. I'm normally very chattery and very high energy, but I found, especially after um, Raph and Olivia's talk, he talked about thickening the blood and I really felt that slowing down and coming back in my body actually and allowing myself to experience this humanity. One of the main things I'm gonna take away from it is like the meditation um, and all the different types of meditation. Um, it's something that I've tried before, but coming here and learning about tapping meditation and different things, different techniques you can use to kind of get into the zone has been really, really, really good. Um, it's definitely something I'll take away um, from here. People are really sharing their truths about their journeys, and that's really inspiring and helps consolidate my own journey using different practices. And it's great to hear how various things have helped them and how really it's tapping into our own selves and us having the treasure trove within us to um, use to help our own healing. The laughter yoga I just found absolutely amazing and it managed again to clear my angst from this morning and it just reminds you of how easy it is to shift your energy from one to another. There's so much anxiety and mental health and all this stuff going on in the world at the minute and actually when you actually leap inwards, all the answers are there and you can heal from within. I think everyone could do with a bit of healing, I don't think, and I've, I've personally not suffered from any particular trauma myself, but I guess there's no harm in kind of learning about healing before something happens, you know, so you kind of know how, like what to do and ways of dealing with things next time, and you can also kind of share share learnings with other people who might have gone through something, so it's definitely good for everyone to, to come to things like this. I'm definitely looking forward to the next one. Community is important because our trauma makes us feel alone and there's, there's huge healing. Immediately you hear someone has the same experience as you because we all have the same experience in different flavours and as soon as we hear that we're like, oh, I'm not alone and we feel that relief, I'm getting goosebumps everywhere. Just the relief of not being alone on that journey. And there are people that get us. To be understood is, it's the most connecting thing in the world, to be deeply understood by someone who really gets what you've gone through.